The following is a production of The Reporter, Delaware County's leading news source. Good morning on Thursday the 8th, and once again, it's a wet morning. We've had rain part of the last five days in a row. And we've had decent temperatures recently. In fact, the good thing is the decent temperatures are going to hang around. I wish I could say it's going to be clear, but then I'd be lying. Right now, the ground is totally saturated. Even the rain we just got this morning, which wasn't predicted, it just suddenly showed up. We now have about two and a quarter inches of rain already for this month. Okay, and today's the eighth. Expect showers to develop late this afternoon into tonight, and then expect what's left of Tropical Storm Debbie, which was Tropical Storm Debbie, then it wasn't, and then it went offshore and became Tropical Storm Debbie again. We're not going to get what happened down south. Some of those places now have 16 to 20 inches worth of rain and things are just overly flooded like you wouldn't believe. But it's going to get here. The only good thing about it right now, it's still only moving at about six miles an hour. As it comes up the coast, it's going to join with a low pressure and the jet stream, and it's not going to hang out here that kind of length of time. But they we're right at where they put the flood watch. And then they said, well, Delaware County could be included for tomorrow. Okay. They're talking, even if it isn't included, another two inches of rain, which I hate to say it. You know, if you look over the history of the fair, and I hate to say this, it's either a muddy beginning or it's a muddy end. Well, this will be another muddy beginning. Let's hope it, we don't get any more than about two inches of rain because I don't think we'll have to worry about flooding. More than that, we might have to worry a little bit. We'll have to wait and see. The outlook right now for fair week, nice temperatures in the 70s. I'll take that. And please remember, the whole thing with the fair is watching the kids and their animals, people from FFA and people from 4-H, and they do a lot of work with all their animals and everything else. So go down and at least appreciate all the work the kids have put in. And who knows what else might be down there. I haven't been down there yet, and I don't know what day next week I'll get down there. We'll have to wait and see. I might go Thursday because it's Senior Citizens Day and I'm 71, so I can get in for five bucks, I think, or whatever it is. We'll have to wait and see what happens to that. But it should be, they have sun out all week long. So let's hope it'll be a good one for the fair. And let's hope tomorrow isn't as bad as they say. They did say if we get some of the thunderstorm put tomorrow, we could have some high winds. And then they stuck on the Weather Channel anyway this morning, the possibility of a tornado. I'm getting sick of this in New York. We've never had so many tornadoes as we've had this year. And it's like, ick. So let's hope that doesn't happen. I'll take the rain. Forget the rest of the wind and what's coming along with it. I got all my firewood in, so that's fine. And hopefully next week with warm weather, my hay will arrive. And then I'm all set. So we'll take it from there. Let's hope for the good part and not the bad part. And enjoy yourself. To subscribe or advertise, call 607-464-4009.